Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is the boy total back again with some Shogun 2 Fall the Samurai. And today we have a 4v4. And, um, well, there is no description to this replay, but looking at the players, um, I can definitely say <clears throat> that, um, we have Trevor, we have Mido, and we have the memers, essentially. Well, yeah, actually, no, just Mido. Um, Imperial, Imperial was not here today. But yes, um, still, it's knowing these people I would definitely say it's gonna be a close battle. But um, before we even start, we just I have we have to go over the army comps, and I'll be starting with the blue team, and uh, the blue team's right here. And uh, I'm just gonna go down here and then sneak around. Um, I'm gonna actually put this on slow motion because we can actually see more units. But um. Moral Exen, he's gonna be deploying some Yayashigaru, mix him with some more Yayashigaru, mix him with some more Naganata, Naganata Samurai, mix him with some more Naganata Samurai. Behind them, he has a lot of bows, uh, bow Samurai, mostly bow Samurai, bow warrior monks. And behind them, he has some Katana Samurai. Mix him with some Nodachi Samurai and some Naganata Tents. Behind them, he has some Naganata Warrior Monk Cavalry. And his general. Next player, we have a Fable. Fable Heart. And he's going to be deploying um, some Yari Cavalry, some more Yari Cavalry, a lot of Yari Cavalry, oh my god. And he has some mounted gunners, mix them with some Yari Cavalry, and behind, behind that he has his official line, and that's made up of sam uh, Katana Samurai, some Yari Ashigaru, uh, Mashluk Ashigaru in front lines. Uh, behind them he has Katana Samurai, mix them with, with some um, Katana Samurai, mix them with some Nodashi Samurai. Behind that he has his general, which is pretty dang good looking. And to his right he we have Mortal Streamer and Mido Streamer, what the heck am I saying? He's bringing some um Yoriashigaru, mix him with some more Yoriashigaru in front lines, Yoriashigaru, 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 all across here. Yeah. And behind them he has a whole hell of a uh, sorry, whole units of uh, mounted samurai, mounted samurai, mounted samurai, mounted samurai, mix them with some Daiku Samurai. Some uh, Naganata, uh, Nodachi Samurai. What the heck am I saying? And um, his general, yeah. Uh, finally, we have um, script. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. I have to pause this now. Um, I'm looking at the mini map. Uh, we have the Great Guard. Mix them with some more Great Guard. With mix them with some Bow Warrior Monks. Mix them with some Katana Samurai. A good, a few units of sword. Mix them with some spears. Mix them with some more swords, Waku Raiders. That's weird. Uh, usually you would put Waku Raiders way in front. But um, that's it. We are now moving on to this red faction. And um, this entire force is full of troops. And this is going to be led by Hunter. Once once again, not a very good player. He's going to bring some Yari, Yari Samurai. Mix them with some more. A lot of Yari Samurai. Mix them with some Naganatas. Mix them with some more Yari Samurai. This entire force is made of Yari Samurai and Nagana Samurai. Behind them, we have Trevor's General. Um, his general is actually right here, moving to the east, moving to, moving to the right, my bad. Um, this is Trevor's general, and um, Trevor's army is going to be right here. He's going to be bringing some match like uh, Ashgaru, and uh, the rest of his army is moving here. Mix them with some Kanana Samurai. Oh, sorry, no, no, my bad, this is not his army. Um, I don't know where his army is. Well, I saw it a few seconds ago, but yes. Um, well, we're gonna move on to Yuma, um, this black and red faction, Yumikura Sanda, and he's gonna be bringing some Naganata warrior monks, mix them with some more Naganatas, mix them with some more Yari Samurai, mix them with some more Yari Samurai. On this side, we do have some cavalry, and it's made, mostly made up of Yari Cavalry, Yari Cavalry, Yari Cavalry, and yes, that's it. Finally, we have Keito, um, once again, a pretty, also a very good player. Yariashi. All these players are good players, like, <laughs> very good players, as a matter of fact. Uh, Yari Ashigaru, he has some more Yari Cavalry and some more Yari Cavalry, and that's it for what I can see, and his general, of course. We have some two units of Yari Cavalry on flanks, so yes. Um, so I'm just gonna play the battle, and we're gonna, we're gonna see what happens. From the looks of it, this entire team is shifting right. This The red team is shifting right. Um, and, oh, this is where Trevor's army is, oh my god, okay, okay, wait, 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 stop, okay, pause, um, slow motion, Trevor has the gorilla deployed a lot of Kishu ninjas, 
and they're just gonna be charging out of this forest a few seconds ago. They're actually going from some Nagano Warrior Monk Cavalry, which is not a bad choice. I would actually, yeah, these Yuri actually go as a matter of fact are already routing. Holy cow! Now behind them we have some Bow Warrior Monks, and now we need to get some Katana Samurai into the front lines, which is what is really needed. These uh, Yuri Ashigaru are, are getting routed, and now he's going after the bows, which is not a bad idea. Finally, he has some Waku Raiders that are preparing to just move in. And at this point, I'll be sending in the cavalry. And as a matter of fact, this entire force that was right here, uh, Sanda, is just going to be attacking this army uh, by Fable Master. And, um, they, and they're going to be attacking this. At some areas, it doesn't look too well, but some areas, it looks pretty well. Uh, right here. And uh, Hunter has also joined the fight. Wait, actually, no. Hunter has joined in the fight. And so, yes, that's that. Um, yeah, most of Hunter's army is also Kishu Ninja, so uh, these guys were. Uh, might on the team were just memed. <laughs> the memers got memed, so that's pretty funny. But yes, uh, at this point, the lines are being shifted to, I don't know how they're being shifted, but Mido and the team are just rushing over here. My question for Mido, did he really just seriously bring all these Yaryashikaru? Besides the fact that he brought some cavalry units, which are pretty good with the amount of chevrons, but that said, um, yeah, they're good for kiting. I would, yeah, um, this is a pretty good play. Um, bring up the Mashalaka Shikaru and start firing at the blob of Kishu Ninja and um, Yari Samurai. They have to get their volleys off. Uh, yeah, they're moving them back, which is a smart idea because they have the protection of the Yari Ashigaru. So that's good, that's good, that's good. Um, and these swordsmen are going to be defending, which is not really what I would do, but sure, go ahead. Um, on this other side, um, Kishu Ninja against Bow Warrior Monks, and the Bow Warrior Monks are definitely losing. Yari, Yari, Yari Ashigaru is just being thrown in just to help sta stabilize the line. Um, some Mounted Samurai are just trying to uh, help to do whatever they can do and match match the being attacked by um of Trevor's being attacked by some uh, Yuri Ashigaru's so that's good on the other side so this side is pretty much cleared this side is the big trouble and um, from the looks of it um, the Kishin Ninja are pulling through and the, and uh, everyone else is trying to get the heck out uh, we have some Dutch I'm oh, sorry the mounted gunners, and they're opening fire on this Kishu Ninja, and that is what you should do against Kishu Ninja. Either gun them down, or uh, charging cavalry. And now he's finally charging, gonna be charging in some cavalry, and they're actually going for a lot of uh, spear units. Uh, sorry, uh, a lot of sword units, and thankfully, um, this Yorashigaru of Mido has just broken. He has another Yorashigaru unit on flank, so that's good. But um, And he has some both Samurai to support. Also, some of the cavalry from uh, Mortal X has come back, so that's great. Um, I will be definitely doing hammer and anvils, but um, yeah. Elsewhere, it's actually looking not that bad. Some um, for um, Yakuza Sanda's uh, Yuri Samurai is being thrown back, and uh, Katana Samurai is being held. But um, there is a unit of heavy gunner. Oh my god! I have a feeling I know what is going to happen. Oh my god! Oh my god! Don't let them fire. At all costs, don't let them fire. These guys will absolutely tear people into shreds. 27 kills and they only fired half a volley. Not even half a volley, as a matter of fact. Um, but, um... Yes, this entire cavalry force is Kato. Uh, from, from the red team is gonna be attacking. And for those who are wondering who, who's on whose team... Um, let me pause it for a second because it could be get confusing. The blue team is Mido's team. The red team is Trevor's team. And, um, yeah, that's the best way to keep it simple. And, um, anyone who see, you see on that is blue here is the blue team. I, I think that should be self-explanatory. But yes, let's continue. But, um, yeah, these heavy gunners, right, where are they? Yeah, right here, are doing a lot of damage. Like, literally, every, every arrow needs to be focused on these guys. And they are. Thankfully, they are. But I just don't think they're being focused fast enough. Um, the front lines are starting to look like a lot more chaos again. Um, some Yari Samurai has broken through. Uh, thankfully, someone has used someone has used um, Whistling Shot. That does mean that um, some no Dutch Samurai of the enemy, of the friendly team is going to be using Whistling Shot. Thankfully, they put Bonsai, so that's not going to make the morale drop. 
Oh, uh, who's general is in breach? Danger. It's probably Midas general, but okay. Um. On the other side, um, Trevor's match look Shigeru has come back, and um, now um, the problem is is Midas streamer's Yari Shigeru is being attacked by two units. Uh, of Nagana Samurai. Someone has brought fire rockets, and that person is Midas streamer. Wow, fire rockets, getting 142 kills. Whoa, just from a few volleys. Um, that is unfortunate. Um, so one ally has already fled, and it's starting to get laggy. Um, but some units are coming back, so that's great. That's great. That's great. Um, uh, Mido still has a few reserves of Yuri Yoshigaru that has seen some action. On this side, um, yeah, I don't think he realizes this unit came back and now just getting shot apart. But um, that's it. I would. Um, yeah, this is this is not looking good. One general is already popping square formation to ma maintain the morale of his uh, men. And this is from the blue team, so that's great. The red team, red team is having their cavalry flank big time, and that's going to be the the problem. Um, Mortal X, which is on the blue team, is trying to hide his uh, cavalry, and but I don't think that's enough. I don't think that's enough. Thankfully, he has some Yarashigaru, but this cavalry could easily go around this Yarashigaru unit. Um, and most of the Yarashigaru is being sent on the front lines. Um, cavalry from Mido is retreating to deal with this massive cavalry blob. This general needs to get the heck out of there. Uh, run to the safety of the Yoriashigaru, but once again, like I said, Yoriashigaru, this unit, one unit of Yoriashigaru can definitely be absorbed. Um, this, this blue samurai needs to get the heck out of there. Um, this cavalry is somewhat getting warded off, but um, I wouldn't charge it, I'll just hold. Uh, but elsewhere on the front lines, it's not looking, it's looking so far so good for the blue team. They're holding, and um, it's not that bad. It's still anyone's game, obviously, but, um, but, um, where's the enemy cavalry? Okay, wait, where's the, where's the cavalry? Oh, probably in the street line, but, um, it's still anyone's game. Some of, um, Trevor's Kisho Ninja has actually come back, but now they're getting routed. Um, some of Trevor's, once again, some of Trevor's Kisho Ninja are actually trying to assault the general. And I'm sorry for the lag, um, but this general is going to be right here. General versus ninja. And I'm pretty sure if this general dies, this army's morale, morale is going to break. I don't know whether that was friendly fire. Or... Oh. Well, um... Amido has just also committed his general. So, uh... Two generals in this area. If this ninja can... Actually, no, I don't think so. Um... Trevor's general is also being popped in the square. Uh, to improve the morale, and to make the situation worse, um, Kato has this um, a good line of um, bow warrior monks just firing into this massive blob. Uh, thankfully, the front lines is starting to look like the blue team is winning, but um, on the other side, well, actually no, it looks like the blue team is winning in some areas, especially on their right. Um, their left is still a little bit chaotic with the cavalry charging in right now. Oh my. Um, this is two generals, so I would really watch out. Uh, if you have any reserve units of Yari Ashigaru, put them here. Oh my god, this entire cavalry force is attacking now. Um, I like how there's a unit of Nagano warrior monks attacking some Yari Ashigaru. But, um, if these guys have any guns or heavy gunners, uh, I wish they, I don't, I don't think they do. But, um, Mido Streamer's general is being sent in. His uh, some Yara Ashigaru units have also been sent in, and uh, uh, Mido is desperately trying to pop rally and inspire. So uh, hopefully that works. I like how this one cavalry unit is just standing on the flank, um, which is like yeah, he's going to charge into some uh, mounted gunners and some uh, match like Ashigaru, which is definitely going to break them. At this point, um, at this point, I don't see the uh, the, 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 the the this team, the, the red team, capitalizing on what they've just done. However, they also have their own troubles with one unit of Nodachi Samurai charging at the enemy general, and another unit of Yari Ashigaru just wandering around. Uh, this general is actually going to go for the Yari Ashigaru, which is which is not the great greatest. But uh, that said, this cavalry force has somewhat been contained. Uh, most of the cavalry has obviously fallen back, so that's unfortunate. Um, Well, um, yes. 
There are some troops on the back line, so that's unfortunate. And um, there's not a lot the allies, the, the blue team can do. They're somewhat in a square, a circle formation now. Uh, they're being literally attacked from all sides. This unit of 52. But um, where's the rest of the... Oh, okay, we have some Mashal Ashigaru from Trevor. And they're, I'm definitely sure they're going to be firing at this uh, Yari Ashigaru from uh, Mido. But um, that said... That said, these guys are in a somewhat of a precarious situation. Uh, they are surrounded, which is terrible. Um, mostly, is, uh, the, behind them is cavalry and two units of one is Katana Samurai, one is uh, Naganada Warrior Monks. Um, but they've also routed, just routed, uh, Mashalaka Ashigaru unit, so that's great. And at this point, it's still like it's anyone's game, but just look at the amount of dead. <laughs> Piles of dead. Like, literally, I. If, if if more battles are being sent in like this, I literally may have to suggest that I need to lower the graphics, which is something I really haven't been doing, because uh, most of the battles that these days are not really that, um, that, um, graphic-y. Well, just look at the amount of dead. Like, literally, the amount of dead is... Holy cow. And, yeah, not so much on this side, because there's not a lot of dead, but holy cow. Well, uh, they were just—they were just scaring off Trevor's general with uh, this bow warrior monk unit. Has—I'm pretty sure it's a bow warrior monk. Yes, bow warrior monk, 175 range, and uh, the good use of this guy's cavalry to ward off um, this essentially this uh, monk monk cavalry monk unit. I'll just charge this in, and the reason why I'll charge this is to make sure these guys are breaking, also to get more experience on your guns. But um, yeah, that's that. But this side, um. It has looks. It has calmed down, and once again, it's still anyone's game. Obviously, um, there are some hidden units, of course, but we just don't know what hidden units there are. This backside has been completely taken care of, and um, it's pretty dang even. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, Mido is making a good decision in sending up his mounted samurai with 175 range. I'm pretty sure he's going after the general, a uh, Trevor's general. The second you kill Trevor's general, what what other units does he have? Some not, Yari Samurai? Yeah, well, is, are they gonna break? Um, do they have any guns? They don't. They have, uh, what do they have? Kinto has some Yari Cavalry, with some Yari Cavalry, and he has another general. Um, Yari Samurai. Mostly Spear units, so that's not good. And it's Katana Samurai, so that's good. Um, the allies, the, the blue team, oh, the, the blue team is a unit behind enemy lines, okay. Yeah, we have to remember this unit because I'm pretty sure, we, based on the way that they're hidden, I'm pretty sure that the, the blue team knows what's going on. But that said, um, uh, the allies, the blue team, have some bow heroes, which is, which is the best unit that they probably have. Um, and I'm sorry of the lag. Um, Yarashigaru, mix them with some bow warrior monks. Mix them with some more bow warrior monks. And mix them with some Yarashigaru, mix them with some more Yarashigaru and some katana swordsmen. And they have one. Oh, they have a mesh lock unit. Oh, so that's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, they just have to make sure that one stays alive. They also have an Avatar Jones bodyguard. And, um, katana samurai unit. But, um, yeah, they have. Three generals that are still alive. And the last one, the last player I think, just got deleted. Uh, Mortal X got destroyed. On this side, um, two generals. And yeah, that's it. But both sides are not willing to attack. Because, one, uh, you attack, you're attacking a tree line, which means bows are not going to be that effective. And two, probably most importantly, um, cavalry is not really effective in the tree line, so both sides are not willing to attack. So I guess we have to wait here. But I'm actually going to fast forward to see what is, else is going on. Trevor is actually sending his general. Um, and... Oh, he's using that tactic, okay. Oh no, he's not doing that anymore. Um, the cavalry is going to be sent forward. Oh, uh, some kiting action. 
but they're going to just be blown away by the superior range of um, the blue team's archers. Um, they do have some bow warrior monks that uh, they should they sh are also sh yeah they're firing now. I think. Trevor's general is being sent up again. I'm pretty sure that's the draw flyer. Yeah, I have a feeling I know what he's doing. He's basically moving his units back and forth. And the reason why he's doing that is because um, when you move your units back and forth, basically the arrows, usually um, archers usually target the way that they're going, so yeah. But yes, um, we're just gonna fast forward. Oh, uh, do we have an archer duel? No, we don't. Actually, no. The blue team is not responding. What are they even firing at? These guys are hidden by the, by the stands. But I don't know what they're... Oh, I think they're going for the general. Actually, no, these guys are also hidden. So both sides are hit, having their units hidden. So that's... Interesting. I'm gonna fast forward. And by the way, the morale, the balance of power is dead even. Um, the blue team is shifting cavalry to their left. With some Yoria Shigaru. Oh my god. Oh, they, there are more units. Okay, yeah. I think I think these guys are scanning. And we have a Yoria Shigaru unit from Kento that is. Almost full! Oh my god, that is going to be a game changer if used correctly. Now, it looks like the red team is going to be attacking. They've sent some katana samurai in the front lines, mixed them with some yari samurai. And that is the main reason why they're doing that is going to be um, because they want their bows to do most of the work, which is not a bad decision. Uh, the, 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 oh my god. The red team's cavalry is charging once again through the screen line and with some yari ashigaru. Um, they need, really need to contain this cavalry because this cavalry can do a lot of damage. Um, these bow were, uh, but mounted samurai are not that bad in... Not that bad in melee. Actually, no, they're quite bad. <laughs> I take that back. Um, but that said, um, the front lines have begun heating up again, and this katana samurai is once again charging into some Yari Ashigaru, which have just routed. Oh, great. And one, they just lost their general, um... The blue team, one of the blue team's general is dead. Uh, and now he's routed from the field. Actually, no, he he's right here. He's right here. The blue, he's uh, Fable is right here. He's just pop, he's just pop bonsai. But the situation is not looking good. It's not looking good at all. Um, Mido's general is still alive, but uh, his men are starting to waver. We already have one general as fighting on foot against. Oh no, fighting fighting on horseback against. A horde of katana samurai, it's 45 katana samurai. The katana samurai are wavering, but at this point there's, they still have a lot of reserves and I'm pretty sure- Oh wait, what, what is going on? Oh no, these, these, um, this, um, katana, katana samurai has just charged in. And, uh, but yes. So both sides have just charged in their katana samurai. But I have, I have a feeling that this unit is going to have the better of it. And the reason is because one, they're charging against into a forest against. Oh, wait, actually, no, no. This side is pretty much. It's going terribly, but not that bad. So Mido is going to be sending in uh, units to to attack this general essentially. Um, if I were if I were him, I'll be doing uh, hammer and anvils. There's only five units left of this unit, but yeah, uh, um, yeah. Um, you're now going against some Yari Ashigaru, which is, uh, I wouldn't really be doing that. We have a bow bow unit of Daiku Samurai by Mido Streamer, and he's going to be shooting at the, at the Yari Ashigaru, I think. Yeah, that's a good choice. But on this other side, uh, Mido's general, this dude's general, uh, Tre oh, it's actually no, Trevor's general, Mido's general, and Fable's general are just going, are, are trying to stall this Yari Ashigaru unit, which is not a bad choice. Um, uh, Mido's general is dismounted now. Trevor's general is dismounted, but he's one of his bodyguards just died, and he's actually not in 
square formation, so, but there's only two people in his square, so that's unfortunate. And, uh, Trevor's, Daiku's, okay. Okay, um, wow. Um, don't mind me, I'm taking a screenshot. This is bloody beyond... This little this battle was literally bloody, like beyond recognition. But uh, what I was about to say was the fact that literally, um, Mido's general just got killed, and that made the Daiku Samurai. Uh, sorry, Mido's general was not killed, but the Dai uh, but his general unit broke, and that meant the Daiku Samurai broke after that. So, well, Trevor and um, his allies took the field, but it was a very costly victory. As a matter of fact, just look at the amount of dead. Uh, once again. Like, the amount of dead right here is like, okay, it's literally like some people's, like, it's literally like some people sprinkled the colors in. Like, that's, that's how interesting it is. Not to mention this entire tree lines, the amount of dead. But yes, uh, that is pretty much it for this battle. Guys, have a great day and I'll see you in the next one. Now, before you leave, I would like to thank you very much for watching this video. I would be honored if you could like and subscribe to the channel. Remember, more videos are coming out, so it is a good idea to click on that notification button. Anyways, have a great day and I'll see you in the next one.